Well, Chapo, get back. It's not safe. It's not safe. Get back. Get oh! Oh! Oh, my God! Get out! Get out! Get out! You're gonna hear me this one on your own. You think so? All right, guys. What's going on? Legends. Early morning today. We have two units that we have to unload. But first things first, I have to go and get my box truck. probably wondering what am i driving ladies and gentlemen i did get the truck so really quick check this out on the process of getting this truck and then once the light comes on we'll give you a good look at it okay guys still on the journey we officially got the box truck Woo! haven't been here for a while but look at this road oh my goodness this kind of road, we were, I don't really drive on a road like this often, guys. This is definitely, it takes country road to the next level, guys. No lines, just nothing but farmland in Ohio, guys. Farmers. Oh, yeah. So I'm excited to see what's inside the unit. I have no idea what we're going to go see. I know, I know one of the units Jeremy tried to buy off me. The other unit, I just seen some speakers and I was super excited about the speakers. Um, either way, we're gonna have a good time showing you guys these storage units. And this is what Storage Legends is about. All right, here we go. All the way and so far away. It was a, it was definitely the country roads, that's for sure. I love the country roads because you get to see all the animals. All right, here it goes, guys, the small barn. Remember guys, we don't call this a shed. This is definitely a small barn. Here it is. Let's hope there's treasure in here. All right guys, behind me is a small shed that I purchased for, I don't even know what. You guys can reference the videos. I think it was like three episodes ago. Guys, who knows what's inside of here? It's not a storage unit, it's a small shed guys. But we're still the small shed legends today. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, here it is. Here it is, guys. Tons of crazy stuff. Who knows what's inside of here? Who knows what's inside of this unit? But look at this right here. Check this out. We got baseball cards. Yeah, look at all these. Wow. These are going to be uh, 88, 1988. All these cards, look at that. Not bad, not bad. Guys, got tons of cards in here. This is going to be crazy. Who knows what else is inside of this insane unit. I see so many other things, guys. There's, there's tons of things. Let's see here. All of these vintage bottles. One pint... It's got that symbol at the bottom. It says a federal law forbids sale or reuse of this bottle. Wow. So there's tons of vintage bottles in here. Let's see, we have, we have this tote too. Look at all these vintage bottles. Holy crap. Old 7-Up bottles. Royal Crown Cola bottles. These could be worth some serious money, guys. Let me see. What does this say? Fago. Look, an old Fago bottle. No way. Oh, Fago, look, this one has grapes on it. I wonder how many how many bottles do we have here? Look at this. Wow, look. Wow, look at all of these bottles, dude. Holy crap. That's not a milk carton. What's it say? That says Ro Roman. It says Roman. Look at all of these bottles. This guy must have obviously he must have collected bottles. That's crazy. Wow, more bottles. Holy crap. Do you guys think this is the real question here? Dad's no deposit. The real the real question is, do you guys think that he actually drunk what was inside these bottles? Or do you guys think he was thrifting this stuff? 
comment below. Hey, that is, I mean, there's so much stuff. Like, this is all just... Look at that. These are all the tops. Old school tops to the bottles. Or, or maybe these are tops to like... Uh, like mason jars, like old school mason jars or something. Um, so we got bottles in here as well. Oh wait, what is this? These gotta be antique as well. These old school light pieces. Insane, insane, guys. I didn't, I didn't really like know what to expect in a box in a, in a in a unit like this. This this engine thing was supposed to. It was supposed to be a joke for this engine thing. Um, for it to be decor in a yard, but look, here we go. Old lids. Check that out. Oh my gosh. Old lids, old school lids to the bottles. Yeah, these are probably going to be on the auction, guys. I'm sure you guys, are, so somebody out there is probably going to want these. Old bottles are highly collectible. Like, check all these out. These are all green ones. It was like seven up, seven up vibe. Oh, spoke, spoke it into existence, guys. Seven up. I've never seen a seven up bottle like this. Like I, I, you know, I, I do this, guys. I always I'm around old stuff, pretty much twenty four seven. I've never, I've never seen a, a seven up bottle like that, guys. At any time, one of these bottles can be worth 30, 40 bucks. We have about ten of them or something. That's four hundred bucks, guys. But um, let's keep going here. So okay, so we have. Got that bottle right there. Blue toe time. Here it is. Ah. Whoa. Whoa. What do you know? More bottles. Oh my gosh. Gross. Grossish. Grossish. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Have you ever tried a grouselish? Guys, get your grouselish here for $3.99 at your local convenience store because you haven't had a bottle until you had a grouselish bottle. What's that say? Oh, wow, it's an old Clorox, Clorox bottle. Clorox, yeah, these gotta be like really old. Clorox, that's gotta be bleach, right? Clorox bleach. So yeah, let's see. Definitely wanna be careful with these because it's just nothing but old bottles. Holy crap, these are worth money, man. These are worth money for sure, the old bottles. Let's see what's under here. I'm assuming it's gonna be bottles. This guy was a heavy bottle collector. Ugh. Okay, ready? One, two. Wow. No way. This is thousands of bottles. This is thousands of dollars worth of antique bottles. And people love this stuff. I'm, I'm telling you, this right here, like this has like Fenton vibes, like old school Fenton glass vibes. Um, Just tons of them. There's just... What's that say? Contents, five fluid ounces. Wow. And then up here, let's see what's in here. Whoa. Let's see. Thermal weld cartridges. Okay. Whoa. We have a... Let's see here. There's a knife. There's a knife in here. Let's see what the heck that is. It says Jill. A Jill knife. Then there's a Pez dispenser. It's a Tigger Pez dispenser from Winning the Pool. And then there is two pennies, one heads up and one heads down, a train, and then a Wizard of Oz character. Wow, so awesome, the Tin Man. That's an awesome box there. Let's see what else we have. Um, looks like a bunch of shells, a jar of marbles, Holy crap. What's this say right here? Important drawing and letter. Don't touch. Uh oh. So let's not, we're not going to touch that. Let's see. Let's see what this is. Wow. Rocks and one free domestic bottle. 
Jeez. This guy has everything bottles. Oh, check this out, guys. Arts and crafts. Whoa. There's shells. Tons of shells. Stones. What's in the back of here? Oh, a butterfly. A butterfly. Let me see. A couple other butterflies. And then let's see here. Um, is that a headless octopus? No, he has a head. Oh, that head? oh yeah, has a fish. Or is it a squid, right? This isn't a small barn. It's not a shed, it's a small barn. So is that a squid or an octopus? Okay, let's see. I just cannot believe how many bottles are here, guys. This is all going to be on the auction. I know you guys are going to go crazy over these. These are definitely some serious uh, collector pieces. Oh, uh, yeah, let's see. What the heck is in there? Wow, let me see. Let me bring this up. Okay, so we have a box. And we open the box. And what's inside of it? A bag. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. An Indian head. Yes. Oh, it's awesome. Or an arrowhead. Arrowhead. And then this is an old school tape measure. Okay. Wow. Wow. Okay. It's safe to say that there are definitely tons of bottles in here. A lot more to go through. Let's see what this is going to tell us a lot here. Oh, plain dickies. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, we gotta, we're gonna dig through these clothes. Right behind us, we have a crate, a nice, beautiful, big chest right under the lawnmower bag. And then over here, we have even more, even more mystery with that nice black chest right there, guys. So let's go ahead and clean this up. I'm gonna get these bottles loaded and we'll check back in. Okay, so in this unit, we keep going. Let me see what's in here. Okay, Felis jersey. Looks like a bunch of fishing poles. That's kind of cool. Wow, really nice sign there. That's actually extremely cool. Um, let's see what else we got. Some cool little hammock. We got a we got a microwave. What else do we have in here? Okay, this box looks cool. We're gonna have to go through that box. Chest, boots. I wonder what kind of clothes are closing here. I wonder what kind of clothes are in here. Let's see. Wow. Looks like a huge bag of what looks to be garbage. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is garbage, Chapo. I don't know though. Who knows? Who knows? You won't know till you till you look through it. It's true. Yeah, it's looking like it's garbage, though. Let's see. Mm. Cans and things in there. Yeah. I'm going to go with garbage. Okay, let's see what else. Oh, man. There's a horse in there. What kind of horse is in there? It's like a Budweiser horse. Is that a bank? No, it's probably just like a mold. Let's see what else we got. Tons of wires. Um, let's see. Oh, wait a minute. Does that, that might go to the horse. Yeah, that might go to the horse. Let's see. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Oh, it's broken. It was already broken when I pulled it out. Let's see what's in here. So you gotta be super careful. Ooh, all the leaves. Nice. Golf. Let me see what we got here. It says Jazzler. Nothing else in this box. Ooh, whoa, whoa, uh, Chapo, whoa. this might be pretty scary. That is 
looking guys I mean we're looking gotta go through it all guys gotta go through it all okay. craft stuff looks like it's a bunch of craft stuff a rim okay so we have that these and this chest to go through right, let's see what's in here okay Digging, we're digging. There's a bunch of straps in there. And arts and crafts stuff in this box here. All right, guys, let's see. Let's see. This is technically like a chest. So let's see what's in the first. This is technically the first chest we're opening up. Let's see what we got. We got a bag, another bag. This is plastic thing. This is plastic thing. I don't know what it's doing. Let's see, just tons of looks like miscellaneous clothes things. We got a little rubber duck. Actually, no, this isn't rubber. This is porcelain. Nice little porcelain duck. Let's see. Okay. Man, just like a bunch of miscellaneous stuff. That's crazy. Let's see what this says. Fear the Rue. Okay. Wow, that's a weird chest, guys. Definitely a weird chest. Not much is in this one. Okay, let's see. Okay, what's in the microwave? Nothing's in the microwave. All right, we got... Okay, let's see what's in here. Ooh, there's tons of... Tons of, oh my gosh. Tons of silver. Okay. See, that's, looks like pewter. And then, yeah, look at that. Tons of just Tupperware. I mean, these could be silver, guys. You want to check all the labels on them. They can be silver. Typically when they're silver, they're bendable. That says silver company. That doesn't necessarily mean it is silver. Ooh, this one. Oh, no, nope, silver plated. So these look like they're all silver plated, but it's still a really cool box of hamburgers on there. Let's see what's in here. Uh-oh, what the heck is that? Okay, let's see. Let's grab a knife. Grab. Let's see here, silver company. Wow, oh, that one looks, that one feels like it's silver. Okay, let's open this up and see exactly what in the world these things are. Whoa, these look like they're like real jade or something. Like a jade rock or something. Wow. That's really nice. Okay, so there's three of those in there. So that was a good find. One, two... Three, those could be like real jade or something. And we got some fishing equipment. Okay. And then, let's see. We've got these. We're coming to the end. This was a little unit, guys. I never really expected anything crazy big in this unit. This is all bike parts. Pedals, seats, pegs. Under here looks like a bunch of, uh, looks like more garbage. Looks like more garbage. What's in here? A whole bag of string. Huh. String. This is an odd unit, guys. Let me see here. Okay, let's see if there's anything good. Nope, that's screen printed. Um, that's not good. Yeah, let's see. These are all kind of like modern shirts. Modern like clothes. This one looks um it was modern to like a biker shirt. Yeah. Oh, 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 It says basketball. Yes. Okay, we're going to see this here shortly. Let's let's keep going. We got a Hot Wheel down there. A Hot Wheel. Let's see. Let's keep going. He's hiding things. What's this? 
Oh, oh, a dollar. A half of a dollar. Another not legal tender dollar. Okay, all right. That's gonna be end of that tote, but we still have this to look Blue box. Let's see here. Tons of tops. Looks like 1980, 1995 cards. Holy crap. There are tons of cards in here. Whew. Wow. Oh, there goes a rookie. There goes a rookie. Wow. Michael Cage, John Stockton. Byron Scott, Larry Johnson, crazy guys, crazy amounts of cards, guys. We got two chests to look through. Stay barn, tuned. Uh, a small barn. I really didn't think there was like that much stuff in here. There's a lot of stuff in here, um, but we have two more chests to go through. Without further ado, let's go through this chest first. In three, two, whoa! Oh man, let's see. We have, we have, um, oh, what was that? Woo! All right, guys, let's freeze that frame and see that one more time. Yeah, guys, you see those eyes. That's a mouse. What was it? I don't know. Was that a mouse? I feel like that was a mouse, Apple. Oh, look, it's right there. Is it? Yeah. Where's it at? It's running away. There it is. Woo! 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 Stop! <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> Sorry, Joe. All right, we're done with the mices. Okay, so I think that, I think I'm nervous now. What do you think? Oh yeah, it's, it's pretty interesting unit. I do not like mice, <laughs> so. Okay, yeah, let's not mess around with any mice. Oh, oh, oh my God, get out, get out, get out. Get out, get out. Oh my gosh. There's a whole nest of mice in here, I think. Oh my gosh. Where did Chapel go? I think Chapel's scared. All right, yes. Oh my gosh, there's another one. Chapel. There's another one. You're, you're really just gonna leave me hanging? You're gonna leave me hanging? Yep. Wow. Wow, some partner I have. Oh my gosh. I don't know what the heck that is. Oh, I think there's a nest in here. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 Chapo, get back, it's not safe. It's not safe, get back, get back, it's not safe. Okay, oh my gosh, okay. Okay, that seems like it's his house. It seems like that's his home in there. Um, I think we have to go through the other chest. I don't wanna invade anybody's home. It's pretty bad, there's a whole infestation. The one guy jumped out and he just left. He, he jumped right off the ledge and he was like, I'm out of here. No, sir, ain't it? No, senor? No, senor. You're in here with this one on your own. You think so? Yeah, I'm gonna break down these boxes. All right. You see how he peeked out like that? That's crazy. Okay, all right. All right, looks like I'm recording on my own now. 
Be careful, Chapo. Keep looking at the floor. Okay. Yeah, this is kind of gross. Um, yeah. I'm kind of nervous now. I really don't want to... I really don't want to have like an infestation of mice come come at me because at any time these mice could just completely come at me and and then if i die guys there's no more there's no more storage unit videos and we, we definitely want storage unit videos so oh be careful chapo be careful chapo wow Wow, look at all the mice poop. Holy crap. This was somebody's home. This was this was the mice's home. Let's see if let's see if the mice live in here. Whoa! Wow. There's a huge scale, and that right there is going to be the storage unit. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let's see if he peeks again. Yeah, yeah, they're in there, they're in there. There's more than one in there? Yeah, they're in there. Oh, heck no. There's tons of them in there, Chapo. They're oh, everywhere. No. They're everywhere, Chapo. Oh, okay. okay. That is okay. Okay. All right, just, just make sure that you just... Everybody just pray for the mice right now. Pray for the mice. All right, guys, that was not the shed. That was the small barn episode and... Unfortunately, I am deathly afraid of mice, so I was just not able to continue. Yeah. Um, it's yeah. all fun and games, guys, but honestly, like, Chop was really, really, really afraid of mice. Plus, we can't really afford a mice infestation. It's just, an, it's, it's, there's a lot more to lose here. So, we had to stop filming that episode in there, um, but stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching, and that's been an episode of Storage Legends.